Okay, we're on 62 East headed toward Eureka Springs. We're not too far outside of, just a couple miles, actually a mile outside of uh, Gateway, Arkansas. And then we turn on this Indian Creek Park Road right here. The, there's a junction here. If you go left, you're going to go to the dam side park, which is Beaver Dam. And Indian Creek Park is to the right. We'll go this way. I will take a tour that way in a later video and show you Beaver Dam uh, and the campground over there. 
the dam site, campground. But right now I'm going to take you down and show you Indian Creek Campground, which is my favorite. It's peaceful. Very good place, a good place for the kids. The water down here at Beaver Lake is absolutely crystal clear. Uh, a lot clearer than Table Rock. I think that's why there's a lot of uh, people come down here and doing scuba diving. I notice a lot of that down here. And I'm sure it's because the water is so clear. I take my boat out down here from the dock and I can go out in 30 to 40 foot of water and see the bottom just clear, crystal clear. I can see everything on the bottom. Very beautiful lake. See one of the coves over there we come up and fish in. beautiful drive down through here when it greens up in the summer you can't see the lake as good in spots it's really beautiful but right now you can see the lake better without the leaves on the trees and you can see here is the Indian Creek Park Okay, we'll go down into the park here. This is March 23rd. I'm not sure if camping's open down here yet or not. We'll find out. There's your dump station right there for your campers. See the day use fees right there. $4 per day use. Uh, camping fees are a little different, but they vary. Looks like there's nobody here today. Campsite, 30 amp, $18 per night, 14 day limit. Well, we're not going to stay for day use, I'm just doing a tour of the campground, so. Take you around through the campgrounds first. Nice campgrounds. They got some of them that's right down close to the water. That's really nice. Got some up here high if you don't want to be down close to the water. A 
It looks like they're not open for camping yet. I wasn't sure about that. I want to pull over here at this camp guy site and I can show you that right over there on the other side of the lake that's Lost Bridge Marina that's actually another campground over there I'll do a tour of sometime the Lost Bridge Campground Arkansas it's a little bit closer to Rogers uh, by Garfield you go through Garfield Arkansas to get to it but it's a marina so if you're at this campground and you want to run over to the marina it's just a zip across the lake on the boat Or it's actually several miles if you was to go around by road to go over there. More campgrounds right there. These are nice campgrounds here as it's down close to the water. There's a volleyball court right there. They got showers. The showers are right up there. And then down here is a playground for the kids. So the nice thing about these campgrounds down here is your kids can play right there and you can see them. And the restrooms are right there also. Also, the boat ramp. And these sites, all these sites are electric here at Indian Creek. So you don't have to worry about that. This is a pretty new one they fixed up here. And it's right close to the water too. You camp here, you can see your kids play in the water. And, and right over there, it's kind of hard to see probably on the video, but that's Beaver Dam is over there. And that's the dam site campground over there. Take over and show you the boat ramp. Like I say, this is a, one of my favorite campgrounds. Probably my favorite campground to come to. It's in Arkansas and not in Missouri, so it costs us more for fishing license be, because it's out of state. But uh, it's just so nice down here and peaceful. And the water is so clear. You can see right there kind of how clear the water is. It's it's amazing. That's the boat ramp. Take you over this way and see there's a campgrounds here close to the lake also and they're also electric but I want to show you if it's not closed off over here there's a swimming area on this side and day use area more campgrounds up here nice peaceful place nice place for walking and they've got it shut off so I can't show you the the day use area um, you can kind of see it over there they got uh, picnic tables they got a restroom in a swimming area but it is shut off you can see the April 1st is when they open it looks like give the times and no camping in the day use area and you got to be out by 10 o'clock and I'm thinking they probably shut these gates at 10 o'clock and if you're not out of there you can get shut in there too you can kind of see the swimming area where they're outlined on the other side but I'll take you on another tour when the leaves are out and show you a, when it's all out in foliage how it looks
and show you the day use and area in this the swimming area but this is a very beautiful peaceful campground to come to it's near Arkansas Missouri line and so it's close for Cassville it's not that far from Branson it's not that far from Rogers or Eureka Springs But I hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, I'll be doing another video of the the dam site and the trip over to the dam site. It's a beautiful ride over through there, so I want to show you that. And uh, please click on the subscribe button and click like. If you like the video, please click on like. That's what really makes a difference. And thank you, and tell you I'll see you next time.